Now, under those proposed regulations, airlines must follow new procedures if they delay or cancel a flight. CBS 17's Haley Fixler explains the biggest thing the Biden administration wants to see changed. They want airlines to have to foot the bill if they're the ones responsible for big changes to the flight itinerary. This means paying for hotel rooms and even meals. This announcement comes just a couple of weeks before the Memorial Day weekend holiday, which kicks off the busy summer travel season. Flights are looking good Monday at Raleigh-Durham International Airport, but that isn't always the case. I have actually, I flew to Savannah for a golf tournament a couple years ago, and we got stuck in the um, airport and they were closed down. Just five months ago, Southwest Airline passengers stood in line for hours. More than 17,000 flights were either canceled or delayed during the holidays because of a system failure. Many passengers were just offered vouchers. But now the Federal Transportation Department wants to give travelers more control. If an airline is responsible for a significant delay or canceled flight, officials want them to cover more than just a refund. They want them to pay up even to rebook another flight. Officials want airlines also to foot the bill for meals in hotel rooms. I think if it's the airline's fault for, you know, either a delayed flight or you missed your connecting flight, uh, the then I think they should be held accountable. The Federal Transportation Department says they are working with each and every airline to minimize delays and cancellations this summer. At RDU, Haley Fixler, CBS 17 News.